All right. Hello, 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 everybody. I am trying, I'm already trying to keep a straight face, but I can't. <laughs> if you're one of those who are watching there, you know why I cannot. If you're only listening so far, then you haven't even seen who I have here in the studio with me. Yes. It says there, Auntie Felicia, a comedy. I don't know who on this planet, if you're Cameroonian or African, has not heard the name. In fact, last week, somebody came and was talking about Auntie Felicia on the forum, and one miserable person came and said, where now who be Auntie Felicia? I said, they climb on top of your head. <laughs> <laughs> they said, you know, no, as it was a group of, of secretaries, they said, didn't you see at least the XI UK uh, thing? Yeah. And she said, oh, I just don't know the name. I know the anti but I don't know that she did other things besides that. I said, so you thought that was the beginning of her career? No. Uh, yeah. <laughs> she has been on there doing things. And she says, please send them to me. So we sent. That's what everybody was sending, sending their own favorite. Oh, so God. I am so, so privileged, so happy, so excited, so honored to have the one and only Auntie Felicia here in front of me. But I know she wasn't born Auntie Felicia. Yes. I don't think there's the, there's the best certificate anywhere that says first name Auntie, last name Felicia. So yes. who are we uh, talking to? Who is this person actually? Okay, so um, I was, I'm born and been known as Kuo Elonge. Kuo Elonge. Yes. Right. So, that's, that, that, that's a before name straight. Yes, but for one hundred percent, but for. I even had a friend who got rest her soul, uh, Elizabeth uh, Mundua, and she's talk about her auntie Pat, auntie Pat Elonge. Is that a relative yes. of yours? Yes, auntie Pat. That's my stepmom. <laughs> wow, what a small world. Yeah, she was from Guyana. She, yes. she was from Guyana. Yes, so she was married to my dad. Yes. yes. <laughs> Look at that. But the small because yes. I heard the name and I said that's who I I know that name. Oh, interesting. Yes. I, had, I had the best stepmom. Oh, she, uh, I love that she loved me so much. <laughs> oh, look at that. And then another funny story about you. There's another person in a different group altogether. And we're chatting back and forth about this whole same clip, the exact clip when you're advertising the, the, the thing in Coventry. Then I said, okay, Auntie Felicia, and she kept on going, yes, she, yes, she. And we're talking about the person, not the clip. This lady was totally convinced that you actually I said, you know, you know, Auntie Felicia is a guy, right? She says, my, for real? He said, now that I think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Felicia didn't look a little strange. I said, so that's how convincing you are in that yes. character, in that yes. building. So yes. I was going to ask, you know how, you, I'm sure you're familiar with Tyler Perry, because that's his yes. who reminds us of Medea. <laughs> he confesses that he really does have some auntie who kind of is like that. So are you basing this whole thing on a person in your mind or a combination of people? Yeah, it's, it's actually um, a combination of people, but largely based on my mom. <laughs> so like, um, I would say that 60% um, of what you see, um, I would say 90% of the mannerisms are my mom's. Right. Um, so the, the, the influence, I have just internalized her reactions and all of that. So the stories are not her stories. The right. stories that I told are not necessarily our stories, but the reaction, the, 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 the way I talk. Yes. I'm, I'm, I'm not surprised um, to hear that. Because who else likes study? Thank you. <laughs> I was just you going know? to say that. I was just going to say that. For you to do it so well, the person yeah. that you are mimicking has yes. to have been within yes. your immediate entourage. I had a lot of people whom I could, like females, but my mom was I, I say she 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 was a comedian like she, she just made people crack like they her reactions to things her facial expressions everything was just too dramatic you know it was just too interesting so i was like oh i i, I have access to the best <laughs> yeah the best character to 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 copy, to copy from i noticed you're talking about her in the past has she passed yes, yes. yeah she oh, passed right. away in 2017 God rest her soul. Oh, and rest soul. I have been looking for ways of immortalizing her memory. You've done a good um, job. And, and I just, the way this has taken off, I just feel so happy. <laughs> because those who know her are like, oh my God, this is your mom. This is your mom. And 100%. Oh, yes. So, <laughs> so uh, some, people, some people know, if, if people have watched you well enough, they know this is not, I don't know what to call it, Cartier, comedian, just so somebody who's the you can tell a well-educated person who is just putting on this persona 
right yes. there. Because yes. when you see those, especially those those ones you do this versus this, like yes. the one where okay, you you can see the yes. person comes and talks real better grammar, perfect yes. English. In fact, even your pigeon, you will throw a few yes. things inside there, which I know. <laughs> Yes. If you are born inside, inside somewhere, you will not know that those words. So, yes. what has your 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 career, your uh, academic training been so far? Your academic uh, journey been so far? When did you start off? What yes. what did you do? Okay, so let me just. I I studied in Sasa College, so um, had ordinary level, advanced level there. Then I studied journalism and mass communication at the University of Boya. Um, I hold two master's degrees, one in sociology and one in journalism and mass communication. And I am just waiting for my defense or PhD in educational psychology. So, awesome. yeah. I, I, awesome. I, 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 I'm, who will listen, listen to this and go, what? Yes, yes. I mean, to academia, I've worked. I've worked for the. I've worked for long. I I began working with the government with Elections Cameroon as bureau head for communications and documentation. Um, for 10 years, I worked with them for 10 years. I'm presently um, the head of communication and public relations for the Southwest Regional Assembly. Um, for those who are not Cameroon, who are Cameroonian, it is the body in charge of decentralization. So, okay. um, yeah, so I work That there. whole thing, I'm going to follow dossier. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to change the dossier. So basically, that's it. Um, I've always been uh, a bookish person. I love books. That's my, my like my mini library here. So I love books. I I, I, I like, my, first and foremost, I write a lot. I'm a writer, um, creative writer, especially, um, especially or particularly. So yes, I, I think that's it. And I felt like this was a breath of fresh air to a lot of people because comedy had been something that seemed to have been relegated to school dropouts and just rascals and all of that. And I felt like it was such a, a huge disfavor for us in this country because in other countries, quite frankly, you must be smart to right. actually be a comedian. So right. I felt like, in, in, and in many ways, it was justified in the type of content you saw. It was very illiterate. It, it was very, very rude, very vulgar. Rude, yes. Rude. And to me, I could not deal with the vulgarity. That, to me, that was the one I could not. And also quite cliche and very stereotypical of you. It was a whole bunch of masa this, masa this, masa yeah. anything. Yeah. And, and, and trust me, the biggest problem I had was with the fixation on UB girls, particularly come on comedy. So mm -hmm. everything was UB girls were dressed like this. And, and I was like, this is not even No funny. creativity. There was no creativity. Like, and I understood, I, I, I could understand like, okay, how education could be an intervening factor. Mm -hmm. And so I do not blame them. I feel like a lot of them also, you know, they did a lot considering the tools they had, you know. Right. Um, they did the what, best with what they had. Yeah, mm -hmm. so but I just feel like we could do better. True, but I, I would also say there is something, because I don't know what your own outlook on the whole thing is. You are born a comedian, you don't make yourself one. Yes. yes. That's you have true. to be a funny person. I, I, agree. Period. I agree with you 100% on that. I mean, you have to be fundamentally funny. Yes. You should be able to, to be ridiculous, to see the ridiculous, to be able to do the ridiculous. Thank so I, I think that you're fundamentally supposed to be funny. But the fact is, and, and this, I think that it's, it's not contestable, is that education provides certain layers to how you do it. Exactly. You know, and exposure. Correct. And, yes. Correct. You, you, you have the base that you are a fundamentally funny person. Then you add to that the fact that the exposure and everything, and it spices exactly. your repertoire is vaster. Everything exactly. that you know about, you see what, but you have to be able to see the fun, the fun in the things. Everybody yeah. goes to this. Yeah, 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 I, I, will, I will start copying your, what you're saying because you're just saying exactly what I have to say in just your words. <laughs> but look, look, look. This, this, when I got your number, I was like, hey, look, you don't know how excited I am. To yeah. see a funny person, because I I like, I crave, I love humor. And yeah. the, the two of us will go to a place, something is happening. We can be sitting there, but what we see, <laughs> what we're able to observe. Oh my God. You know, I, I remember when I started, I was doing something. It was like, um, it was like reviews of weddings. So I'll go and I'll, I'll be talking about the good wedding with fish note. Uh, they say, take if you take fish note, take fowl. And you know, the thing I noticed, <laughs> so, this is what we all we all know how people don't really notice it you know they might grumble about it but don't really see the the funny part exactly you know? yes, that, that yes. is you have a, a an amazing and uncanny way of picking everything you say there yes 
you are like who hasn't heard that before but who thought to put it together like that and make okay. it yes and that's yes. why we're all funny we're all we're all amused and are laughing because yes. we see ourselves in that thing we um, even see and you know when we like grinding you know all, we all gossip we just we just look for the right person but you know you must have that one person that when you sit with you're like so free <laughs> i mean right. this is not a male or female you have that person that you have, you have to have a gist, a gist, a gist, that on the box <laughs> exactly a, a gisting partner <laughs> yeah just partner. Exactly. but when you wait if, if the person is not there sometimes if you're in the same hall you don't you don't throw the, throw the person eye they say they know exactly what you have, what you have seen when you meet you after, know, you know, you know it one hundred percent. Yes. When you when you meet after, you say, "Mommy, you be seen that this." They say, mm, mm. <laughs> "Can't do too." <laughs> and then if if your gist partner is not there, the thing you just know the thing. Then when as soon as you meet them, knock me five. Yeah. Pra, 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 yeah. pra, you just yeah. you just start. Oh my goodness, you have it. You you have nailed it down to a science. It is so amazing. And, and just you know, in case, mm -hmm. yeah, you know, one of the things I wanted to do. Uh -huh. uh, zoo comedy that was very relatable, especially across generations. Right. So I wanted to do comedy that um, the old, middle age, young, they can all relate. They can see their mother, can see an aunt, can see a neighbor. You know, you will notice that Auntie, Auntie Feli as a character is not sexualized. Right. So we, we, I, I, I shy away from all of that because I wanted the character to be as real as possible. Right. So I was looking at my mom at this age. She wasn't sexual in the sense of talking about those things, and right. I felt like comedy. It was like you don't you don't do that. You don't. You're not vulgar. You don't curse. Then it's not funny. So I was like, no, we can yep. change that. If I wanted totally to debunk that. We're that. About, we, we, we're all fighting. We know we fight, people fight about who is the better cook or who is the best cook. Have who don't bust my pipe for butter? Like these normal things, we never. I just never wanted to do something that was far from the ordinary, where you can see this thing happening. Yes, and you can imagine it. That's exactly <laughs> what happened there. And so it, it, sometimes you have. And I'm now saying things like, "Oh, that's an, an anti felicia moment." <laughs> yes, <laughs> happening there. <laughs> and it's happening there. Even just the parting of the wig, that just cracks me up totally, because that's what we do now. Just fix, fix your skin. That's what I was sitting here trying to do before you came on. I tried to say, mm -hmm, mm, is, how, is it? <laughs> how is it looking? In case there is somebody, right, you just, that's what we do. You really have, you've done your mother, you've done your mother proud. Wherever you yes. can see this, and I'm sure she is pleased beyond, beyond. So, so okay, family status, do, are you married? Do you have any children? No, I don't. I have a fiance, yes. Um, but hopefully, uh, hopefully by the end of this year, She's been very supportive. Uh, oh. I mean, oh, she comes up with some of these terrible storylines. I'm like, your, your brain is more me is messier than mine sometimes. Like, <laughs> she comes up with something, she's behind the camera. It, it's right. never easy to find, um, I would say, a partner who, who would see you do something this uncomfortable at the start and really believe in the fact that this could be something, you know. Right. I don't think that any any woman wants to to, to date a guy who cross dress, even if even for the sake of comedy. Correct. But I was so appreciative of the fact that she could see the bigger picture and the change that we could, we could bring about with this. You have, um, to, we, you have, you have to thank her for me. me. That's yeah, what oh, I do yeah. on this show to tell the debunk some of those things. Yes, <laughs> I am very very lucky. I trust me, I'm very lucky. I agree um, with you. Not just with her, with also with the friends and with family. Oh, because as, as my family, as you might know, is made up of overachievers. Right. And this was not the career path they wanted for me. And for a very long time, I've been following the path that they wanted. And this was like really a misnomer. Like, what the heck is happening? Sure. But we've been able to come on board like so strongly and been so supportive. And, and they're seeing that, you know, the foundation they provided is working. You know, it always. It was not a waste of time. It was, was a, a build up. I am so happy with this whole story about <laughs> the Felicia thing. It is just yeah. the entire thing because I've been trying yeah. to say we have to debunk some of the myths. We grew up. Yes. You need to go lawyer, doctor. That's yes. it. Any other thing? Yay. yay! Your mother is stumbling on you in the cartier. Hey, oh my you want to pick in Dongo overseas? Go do this one. Yeah. No, my picking will come be this one. Hey, my, hey, my. You are right. Very interesting thing. So it wasn't all milk and honey, the acceptance of it, like even from my family. Right. So I give you an example. My elder sister, who is now like my biggest cheerleader, right? She did not like this. She did not because I just picked up 
a very high paying job. I was occupying a really powerful position. Like she could see me really climbing the ranks of government. Right. And she was like, oh, when you have this PhD, you just be sky rocketing, like just going. And when I started this, it, it was a huge disappointment to her, like to her especially. And I could see it because when I, when I went to get like outfit, I would go to her because she's my only sister here. And I'll go to her and she's she's like the same height and everything. So it's only her things I could use. And mm-hmm. she'll be like, see, I guess until I want to for IDPs, if you go for the good move, the Kaba, but no go for my wardrobe. And though it sounded like casual, it meant a lot because she was like saying, you could not wear my things for this thing. You right. know, this is not something that is dignifying enough. Then when I when I began and the fame was coming and it wasn't this type of fame where you're just popular, but it felt like it was impactful and it was touching a lot more people and people were reaching out like, oh my God, like people from just her friends who and say, see, yeah, yeah, small more than I was stress relief. Like when we don't stress the whole day. And then when I signed my first um, um, um brand ambassadorship, it was a multi-million francs brand ambassadorship. Thing. And I went and met her and I gave her a huge package and I could see. I could see the change, the change. like 360. And the next day she was calling me, she was like, I want to go here on the you're not gonna need clothes. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I you see, I don't I, I don't I hear her, I feel her, yeah. I understand her, I get her. Yeah. You see, it will take people, more people like you. That's another thing why I'm just pleased. Because yes. now, because of what you have done, when I had Mola Mongombe on here too, I was thanking him for being him to say exactly. it's time to show people that. That's how you debunk the thing and demystify all of these um, uh, preconceived ideas that we've got by yes. having somebody who comes and excels. And yes. asked my, my, my friend and former classmate, Asheri Kilo, who is a, 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 a member of government, to come and also speak, and she did the same. That's yes. what helps to, to kill those ideas. People mm-hmm. who are bold enough or who are the pace setters or the trailblazers of these things, you will now yes. see somebody else will come and say, but look, when they say you, you cannot do it, he says, but look now, look at Auntie Felicia. Yes. Absolutely. You know, um, it, it, I was even harder on myself because you would ask me, I'm sure this is something you're wondering. Well, you, I should have known I'm a comedian a long time ago. Why, am, why now? You know, I'm, 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 I'll be on Sunday, I'll be turning 34. So why now? And in my, in my mind, I should tell you, I've been harder on myself because I was thinking about all these perceptions about everybody, what society would think, and thinking about class and status. I did not know I could define class with this. I did not know I could, I could actually make this to be classy. I could make this to be, to be dignifying. Like, you know, I did not know that. You, and, you, know, you know what? You know what? Hold that thought a tiny second, because yes. this is what I was doing while I was waiting for you to come on. I hope yes. I can sometimes be such a mess with sharing my screen, yes. but I hope I get this so people can see because they're seeing the, you there like that. Why had yes. I found this picture and kept it there? Oh <laughs> my goodness! Let me see if I can find this and then look. Don't worry about it. I'll, when I open this screen, then I'll find the picture I was trying to uh, yes. do. <laughs> Okay, I know you're not seeing what I'm looking for, but right here, yes. am I sharing my screen? Yes, you are. Is that you on the oh, left there? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I went and stole this picture from I don't know where, but I want, can I even make it oh. bigger? If it were? You see, is that's you on the left. I want people to see, because I suppose yes. we only know you in this lemon green thing, yes. in what you're wearing yes. right now, but that is yes. him right there. Yes. You see? He is yes. in character, understand this, he's in character here, the, the personage, the person in yes. there being anti-Felicia. This is the same gentleman there out yes. of the so-called character. And uh, I want people to see, 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 see shoe for foot. <laughs> see, 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 see watch. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Let me stop this share and, and, and come on back down here, but I wanted to do, I wanted to do, I wanted to do, to do that. So look, I know. Um, yes. I know they're thinking about cross-dressing. Our world is crazy now. So I applaud you because you gotta, you have to, to go through all of that and think, hmm, hmm, how are we going to react that you went for it? Yes. And because you did. It was, um, ha. It, it was something that tortured me I because know. I never wanted the comedy to be drowned in, in rumors and misconceptions. And so that's why you see, I did not even put lipstick and makeup. And you keep, and you keep your beard. Yes, and I, ke- I kept it because I wasn't denying my gender. Right. And I wasn't trying to be some other gender. I, this is right. comedy. And right. 
as much as I wanted to depict the character as best as I could and make it as relatable and believable as it could be, I, I just never wanted to propagate uh, a narrative right. about- And make it, make, it, make it detract from what you're really exactly, trying to do. Exactly. Um, I, I don't air my opinion about cross-dressers. I don't. I say to each their own, right. but I'm not. I mm. don't feel like doing it. I never will do it. But as an artistic form, mm. I felt like this was something that would really grip the public's attention. It has. I felt like I could actually, I could actually stun people more because I could do my oh, stand-up yeah. comedy, do comedy as a longer and and it would still be good. But I did not think that it would have the pull factor that this would have because this was this was like shift. It was like this, this is I, phenomenal. I, this is, yeah. <laughs> this, this is phenomenal and so, 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 yes. which is why I'm telling you that there's somebody there who actually took you for real and thought this is a real person. Oh my God. I receive those messages every day, trust me. And they, 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 like sometimes we're like, so, but I think leave my dad. I'm like, no, I have an auntie who has beards. Like, this is not something, it's, it's just the acting is so good. And, and to right. me, when I get that, it's very fulfilling though, because I really want to make it believable. You know, and that's the best compliment you could get where people actually mistake you for this. That's the real thing. So she's, yeah, she, she, she really tried to really argue with me first. She said, okay, wait, let me go back and look. She, then she came back and I said, yeah, I thought there was something for it. I said, you didn't see. And she says, no, I have been looking at all of these things and feeling happy and I was convinced that was the real person. And you see, you, you crack us up, we laugh our throats and hearts off. And then and at, at the time when COVID yeah. came there, people oh, have God. died here and there. It's been yeah. a sad world that has carried a whole bunch yeah. of us over the- me, I should, particularly for, for those in the diaspora, mm -hmm. they are the ones who, who have kept this going um, because of the testimonies that they give. Right. Let, let me tell you, I have, uh, the first time I received a message from someone from the diaspora that really touched me, this, this lady had lost her mom and her dad. And for over two years, she, she told me she had not really smiled, like laughed from within. From her soul, from her. Yeah, and she just stumbled on this from a friend's status. And she was like, oh, this is curious. Like she saw herself laughing and like just letting go. Yes. And she, she asked for, like, you know, the link. And she went to, to, to YouTube or Facebook at the time. And was, was, she was just binge watching everything. And she wrote me and she, she contacted me through my business contact and she was like, you don't know what you've done to me. You oh. don't. Know. And she, she told me this has been my first line of therapy. Right, right. Because this has changed everything. She, she, she was sending me money. I was just like, please, I'm sending you this. It's so that you don't stop. You don't get because to, to keep, keep, encourage you to keep going. Yeah, there are so many people who might not be able to reach out, but they have the same experiences. I have, I have some other person who reached out to me. He was like, I want you to talk to my uncle. He's on life support. But trust me, you need to talk to him. And yeah. the entire family was gathered in America. They were gathered there and, and I came live and I was talking to him. And I saw him lit up immediately. And this is, this is the guy who is about oh. six years. He's been bedridden and he was like, you know, and it felt so good. So to me, this was like comedy. It was first comedy, but now it's like evangelism. It means yeah, so it, it is therapy. It is it is yeah. clinical therapy. It's if working. I, I should be talking to you more, but you give me those words. <laughs> <laughs> it is it is therapy for real. You see, and you yeah. know how something is. You know something is really really funny. Because if I generally if I've heard a joke already before or I've seen something before. If I go and look at it the second time, I'm like, since I already know what's about to happen, it's not funny. Yeah. No, that doesn't that doesn't apply to anti felicious things. It's oh, funny boy. number five time, number six time. It's funny back. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you yeah. laugh against me because the thing is genuinely funny. Yeah. And then yeah. what you're going to talk about what that therapy word I used. Yeah. People will have only seen maybe they really it's just funny for funny sake. Yes. Even though there's always a lesson to learn from every single one of them. Yes. But I the ones that have really touched my heart a lot lately are the ones that you are using to pass on messages about awareness. Yes. Awareness, yes, yes. Um, I, I, for one, I am so, I've been a social worker for long. I've worked in communities and I, I work as a, a researcher for, um, for uh, youth empowerment and women empowerment, um, non-governmental organization called. Um, I've always been very passionate about courses that have to do with women because I grew around very determined and strong women. Mm -hmm. And so that's why that's why I have this love for, for women. Yeah. I want to 
the what the one with albinism i know ebenye ebenye oh, Nicola, okay. i happen to know her in fact that is how we got the got chicken chick, yes. <laughs> so, oh, um, she's such an intelligent sweet girl, like. smart intelligent i when i went to come the last time actually met with her physically finally because the oh. reason that i i do this for sponsors yes. her, her her thing her her born to dazzle foundation yes starting to meet her and then i saw the one that you did with her i was just touched but you see yes. Some of these taboo things, if you just come and start preaching on people and get a big old bolongo and try to whip them into, into shape, it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't work. It's that kind of thing where the bitter pill, it's you, you run up and fine, couch it very well. By the time they, 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 they want to realize that you're giving them a message, they've already learned yeah. the thing, but it has caused them to think. Because yes. then you were there with the crayfish, but that crayfish is said, <laughs> 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 you know, if you cook your arrow, you don't put crayfish inside. <laughs> No, I'm not Nanjanga Ho Eru. for real. So, so you, <laughs> you know what the thing that says this. So you see now, there's somebody there. I bet you, who sat who was sitting down there before they watched that really thought it was in Janga issue. Oh, it's there. It's there. So, the testimonies are there. there. There are hundreds of comments. Actually, there are thousands of comments. But like hundreds of people who who didn't who actually held these stereotypes and this misinformation, this wrong view about al albinism. And, and we're like, oh, and, having and the moments, like, mm -hmm. oh wow. So they do eat crayfish. Oh, this is yes. by son. Yes. This is this, this is that, you know. And to me, these are the these are the things that make this so fulfilling, these social courses and these awareness courses. Mm -hmm. Because comedy is a light way of saying it, but it's very instructive, you know. Okay. People are people are, are at ease, they are ready to absorb the message, you know, their defenses are down, so they, they just get it and they, they don't fight they just yeah. realize oh, okay this is it you know this is so with when i when i did that with albinism that was in partnership with the canadian embassy i also did something that had to do with digital literacy with the american embassy and sister speak that was with komi musa and mm -hmm. i also did uh, um, with something with autism, autism and trust me this you you would always see i always comment on those like you see mm -hmm. me in the comment section for those the rest you don't really see me but even Women's Day and breaking the bias and all of that, right. I'm so happy about those courses because I feel like that's when I, I can actually contribute contribute my voice in bringing about so many. Maybe change. a fantastic job of it, a fantastic yeah. job of it. Then is that is then the the, the, the auntie Felicia to your girl oh wait is it? Hey, hey, I think you're picking a bag. Picking the right transfer, picking the right Oh my goodness, because that's exactly what people say about those kinds of children, poor things. Yes, yes. yes the yes, poor child is sitting there, and then you get a person, then you got an actual person who, because it'll be strange for you to suddenly now sit down there and you start now telling, yes. saying the science of it. So the other exactly. person has to come in there and sit and help to to put the exactly. message across. Say, no, that'd be so. I think, I think Felisa is very instructive because, because of, of how dramatic she gets. It makes it in such a way that you are able, like, I was able to, to communicate the symptoms. Right. Very fast with right. artificial and effectively because so, I mean, yes, yes, yeah, we did a fantastic job of it. Yes, you are able to to communicate those symptoms very fast. I mean, the people I worked with this 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 was when when I sent this the, the preview and to them and the snake peek for and you you could feel them literally crying and say because they have autistic children mm -hmm. and we've been working on this for for like two months building right. towards them and they just wanted to see how it would be done. And I went for the best cast. Kate Fidel is an award-winning actress, a child. And that was her mom, a biological mom, um, Lina. And she too is an extremely good actress. And I wanted you notice that for these things I have to do awareness, I look for the best cast because I want them to deliver on this. And it's not about the money, trust me. Those are those things, those people who have worked will tell you that I usually tell them if I take 500,000 pounds for his kit for promoting, right. when it comes to this, I cut it down. Right. So for the because humanitarian people, things exactly, they're doing. Exactly. What so I are, have you the one, are you the one who does the scripts or they give or they give or they give you a script to do? No, no, no. I I, I always have creative um, um um license. Nobody has ever given me um any any script. I think people trust what I can do now. And trust me, people see just artificial, but I have a very strong team. Your your work is only as strong as the team you have. And what I, what I did when I was building a team was to look for people who were much more intelligent than I am. Because there is no point in getting those who are less than you. Mm -hmm. you, can, you need people who can actually build, add value to what you already have. Mm -hmm. So I, 
I had Howard Maximus is an award-winning writer. He won the Mais Molan Award. Today he won Afritondo. So he's one of the best in Africa. And he's part of the team. He's one of my closest friends. I have Samatanya, I have John Gumba, like people who are at the top of what they do. This is what constitutes the team, um, um, MC Benja. People who, when it comes to social media marketing, it comes to PR, it comes to creative writing, they are they are on top. Because I'm I so just proud. wanted a team of yes men and people who cannot bring innovative ideas. Correct. So to me, this is bigger. I'll give you, a, this is a scoop I'm giving to, just to you. So we've been working on Antiphony, the movie. For we, are, we, are, we want to pitch it for Netflix. And trust me. <laughs> My subscription, I have it already. I was there with Fisherman's, what is the Fisherman other one? Oh, yes, I carried over for head. This one now, yes. I carry a whole Kenja. Mm -hmm. Yes. So we want to, the, what, the goal is to make sure that this is, this is bigger than than, than Cameroon. It's supposed to be global. Yes. That's where I was going next. Yeah. That's where yeah. I was going next. Where can we push this thing and push and push so that it breaks the little mold of just yeah. Cameroon, of just Anglophone Cameroon, but it just oh. wasn't out there. We, we've worked, we are working on that. We are also working on Antifeli, the series, and we'll be shooting it in 4K and all of that to make it meet the standard of the biggest streaming platforms that we have. And I'm for so now, proud. we have the numbers. Trust me, we we are not we are not sleeping because this is not something I will not leave my my normal job and all these other things to come and joke. We, we can do a lot. We can change a lot in society. We can impact a lot through this. And so, to me, I am not taking it lightly. This is not ending anytime soon. It's not. It's only getting bigger. <laughs> Thank God. It should get yes. it as it should as it should. Yes. But we see other people doing the same things, and we keep on saying it's Nigeria, it's Ghana, Nigeria, it's Cameroon. Africa. Why not no, come we can to South Africa? Why not? Well, we yes. have the talent. We have, been, I would say, far better talent. I'm, I'm sorry, and no offense yeah. to them. Far better yeah. talent is just hiding. Yes, it, it took I, I, people like you, yes, to come and, and 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 champion the whole thing. Yeah, you know when when um there is Professor Titanji, Madame Titanji, and uh, Beatrice, there is um Professor Joyce Ashutanta. Uh huh. When I saw them on my page with the top fan badges. Right. I knew then that Antifeli was a, is a hit. Correct. Because, because this is a part of intellectuals who would not just watch anything. Or watching, or even if they even if they watch, if they don't like the yeah. thing, we will keep quiet and, and just say let it let it slide. And, but, and to imagine, uh, 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 Professor Titaji actually look got my number. She got her son to her son is my friend, and she right. when she went to life, she was like, I need his number, and she reached right. out. That's, that's what I was able to. I asked and asked until I said I have to find your number and like let me get the, <laughs> let me get a hold of him because this is something. This is this is really really big and inspiring and I'm glad that you're pushing. And we're we're, we're proud. We 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 want to be able to also stand there and say we have our own homegrown homegrown yes. comedians, not the little riffraff neither here nor that kind of thing, but people with yes. quality who when they sit down now and speak like you're speaking. Yeah. Look at that. And then I when you get in character, very important it's too. Presentation. Um, I, I feel very honored that I have to be at the forefront of that kind of a presentation. So that's why I don't take it lightly. Um, they, I think that there is a lot that a lot of unlearning that has to be done, even in our educational system, right. and a lot of reworking that has to be done in terms of the liberal arts. Um, like you said, your 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 sister Ashley Kilo and friend, you know, and classmate. She understands this because she's in the liberal arts and theater. And right. I think she's done a lot of work to try to, to fuse this in curriculum and, and all of that. And we need more of this. Make it, make it mainstream. Yes, make it we mainstream. need mainstream. Not a thing that somebody has to drop out of school to go and do. Exactly, exactly. Where we know that this is, this is a credible career path, a professional path that people can actually pursue. And don't, we don't feel like, oh, this, this, this is for failures and all of that. I mean, trust me, the new, the new, the new comedians, Anglophone comedians are all really educated. You can look at Caro and Kupis. Um, you look at, at Dokas. Dokas is a graduate from journalism, you know. You you, all of these people are, are really educated. You can get from the way they speak. And to me, it gives me so much joy that yes. they are able, we're able to, to scale up 
and redefine these things. Yes, like yes. that. That's what, that way, when you get go beyond Cameroon's borders and you start coming out there, you can talk and they want to interview you post the yeah. actual stage, being yeah. on stage, you hold an intelligent conversation with the people that you're talking yeah. to. So, hey, don't yeah. take me come on. Hey. <laughs> I don't want that local woman. That don't want to Hey. <laughs> I can hold my own. I can sit on the stage and talk and debate with you. I'm just being yeah. in character. The same way you see the, 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 that pic, that uh, 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 collage I just did there, that's like how you see Tyler Perry when he's attending a thing, he's sitting there, yeah. like that. Yeah. And then when he's being media, he's being media. He is, yes. Um, I remember I was presenting an academic paper. I was to present an academic paper. It was for an academic seminar. And this this very proposed MC <laughs> was, was like, uh, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Antifeli. And you know, I was so I was so angry because sometimes I, it did not show because I took it and, and ran with it like a joke. But you did you did a Chris Rock, you did a Chris Rock. Yeah, and oh, it, yes, 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 I did a Chris Rock thing. And so, but then I was like, no, this is not how you do. But then again, I looked at it. I was like, immediately I finished my presentation. I got a standing ovation. I was like, at the end of the day, this sold this actually sold the character well, and it it, it could actually tell people that. You know, you know there is there is substance behind this. You know, yes. so perhaps, and, and, perhaps, yeah. So that was and, and that is what I wanted this to be to be yeah. that, that that part. We have all seen the character. We know Antifeli, all of that yeah. stuff. But I wanted I wanted this to come out. So when you see the person, yes, it just even speaks even much more to their to your to your to your to your prowess. What you what you yeah. you are able to to do that you are yeah. this person, but you are able to come and. Be this character. No, yes. no, interesting question. Do, 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 do the things clash in your head? What? Oh, no. Uh, okay. So that question is a question that you should ask my fiance because <laughs> 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 I, I really want somebody to interview her and ask her. Oh, I will uh, look any day. So, is, she, is, she, is she there like right now? She works in Limbe. She works with taxation. So she's, okay. Okay. So she's not there right this minute. Okay. No, I would have been ready. But trust me, I'll try to make sure you can talk to her for 10 minutes sometime. Because this Any person, she can, it is they who is they are, in the, they are at the receiving end. So right. they can tell me. Because sometimes I'll say something, and but I'm, I'm funny as a long game. But then they'll be like, nah, Auntie Felicia, they talk so. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm asking whether they think they think there's a, they, in, in your head. I, 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 think, I think I make enormous effort to, to actually keep them, you know, apart. Um, but but they're they're just, just, as a long as I'm quite, I'm quite intellectual. Like my approach to things, I'm actually very level-headed. I I'm really calm. Like I don't, I don't get angry like that. Like I can, I can get angry, but it doesn't get you know. Crazy. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. You're able to play that part, massa. Yeah. And if and if anyone, and if anyone rude is, I just vicariously live through her. Like right. the anger part, I I just project it there. And by the time I read that character, I, I come you, you back. Can, you can get away to really for cautious person. Well, well, so when okay, because I cannot do that. I cannot do in that real life. Longer, right? I cannot do that easily as a long year. So <laughs> <laughs> my good at you, Felicia. Chai. Yeah. Yeah, so, so I think that uh, I make the effort a lot to because um as 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 a comical character, yes, you would laugh, but imagine having her as your friend and all of that, it will not work. You know, you will feel disrespected sometimes mm -hmm. and that's so it will not work as a friend, but mm -hmm. as a character, as a comic, right. comic right. character, right. 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 Yes. yes. But imagine having that type of corrosive person around you. So I say, I say, I take my mother's nuances and all of that because she wasn't necessarily corrosive, but she right. could. I think when she had her, her facial expressions, her sense yes. of humor. The mannerisms is what you, as you said, the mannerisms is what you are doing, the things. Sometimes I do, I, 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 of us do the thing that you see thing and then we, we, <laughs> yes, you, you all with the clap hands say, mm, 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 mm. Those are the things that, <laughs> say, yes, I fix our hair and things. Doesn't mean that the substance of what we do must be corrosive like that. That must be yeah. aggressive like that and or mean spirited like that to talk about yeah. the thing. But as you said, we can say the same things that she's saying, but it depends on who we're saying them to. You have your just yeah. the same master, that place. Yeah. No one's more even foul wings, so not see, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but, 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 but you're not be talking to the whole public like that now. You're telling us exactly. you're yeah, yes, yeah, bow. <laughs> exactly, they yeah, are bow, yes, yes. Is that for you? Are you saying it? Slice house, slice house, like chips. <laughs> <laughs> 
I tell you. So I don't know about about how this works. I know that if I had a musician in front of me, an artist, I can say, take your guitar and play or something. Yeah. I do not know how it works for somebody like you. Can you do you can you do the thing a little skit on the spot? If I give you a scenario, <laughs> scenario now, would you uh, uh, act it out? Would you? Yeah, I mean, um, yes, I can do on the spot. Like that's that's that. I mean, I can do I can do anything. That's not. Uh, that's so so, so let, let, let let me think now. Okay, let me say Auntie Felicia now becomes a teacher in a classroom. She's teaching what yeah. infants one, infants two in the primary school. What would you do, for example? I say the begin. I be sure you be sure say you don't take the doors on your papa because even when he come from yes, so he just he looks from kind to ma. You, you see, I say the man not bright. When I see the picking, so I just know say the picking. He go stay for school. I tell you, they get to. I go try all things to teach picking. You go put a letter A for apple, but even that A in the corner, different thing. I never see the kind thing. Eh? When woman they would the travel Islam, woman they say one married man because they are some man because they are gene the over strong choose better man. Try for see whether the man gets more sense or head. No, you know go carry carry on the United. You bring up for you can't be distressed. But I know for teaching work that we can't carry all door picking they bring us. See picking head. <laughs> I don't go feed. I beg. You better I resign the work. <laughs> awesome. You see that's 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 what I mean by somebody who has it in them on the sport spontaneously. Here's a scenario. Go. And you do it. So if you went to audition that way, they know you're funny. It's not a thing where you have to think it and channel it. Mm, mm, to channel something. To channel something. <laughs> you're channeling this, you're channeling that. You do. <laughs> Ready to go on the spot. You're just naturally funny. And so how can we do to help? Okay, we've gone, we've subscribed. Um, we go and we like. And then we yeah. do what else? Um, I, I think we share. Yes, we share. We share. Um, Definitely. We share. Um, you know, at the start of this, I, I am very appreciative of, of the followers I have, especially those in the diaspora. Trust me, they've been the oxygen behind this. Mm -hmm. Because I started with no resource, really. I, 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 even equipment I did not really have. And it was really my phone. <laughs> it wasn't actually a very good phone either ways. And but when I started, I think a lot of them could see potential. And they really, they really, they really placed a bet on that. And they've been so supportive. You know, they've provided finances, they've provided equipment. And we, if we could dream of doing an anti Feli movie, it is largely because of the support that we've been receiving. You know, sometimes it's just the moral support too. And it's people like you giving us a platform to actually talk mm -hmm. and be on the food. You know, all of these, they, they, they add up. Right. To, so where yes, is it we can go and do this? So somebody's listening now and says, I want to really support this Auntie Feli. I've been even thinking about it. How can I do yeah, it? What can we do completely? We are so we are so agile. All our social media platforms, and you would see our contact number and even email everything there. And we respond within like five minutes because we have a team. And if you want to talk to Auntie Felicia directly, sometimes you mostly, most times you meet just me, you meet me. I am very hands on when it comes to that because some people come there for very personal reasons. It's health. It's, so I'm very hands on. And they'll tell you that, oh, they, they always talk with me. Yeah. So okay. they can go to our social media pages all across all. We are always. Contact you. And then, and then once they get you, then they can figure out how it is that they can donate, how yes, they can yes, do the yes, financial yes. transition, whether it's Momo or what is going on. They can figure yes. that out. Yes, but meanwhile, yes. what they can do before they do that is like, 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 share, like, share, like, share, 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 share. On WhatsApp, just keep hitting that forward button. Keep hitting that oh, forward yes. button. Yes, yes. And when the time comes when you can finally come on out here, trust me, we will be there to attend those things. And okay, in Cameroon now, I see people will call you to do this, like you're saying. Yes, so yes. that's how they can contact you to also do ads, right, and commercials. You will, you will be surprised. Most of the ads and commercials I've done come from people in the diaspora who own businesses here. Okay. So they are the ones who mostly call. Apart, but for the multinational companies, you know, like Prudential Beneficial, those ones are based here. But for individual, like, super proprietorship. Yes, like the one where you say your personal friend, so that extra this thing, you actually call your name, so your personal yeah. friend, so. Exactly. But there are also businesses. Uh, right. Yeah, there are businesses that I've done which have to do with, these are these are owned by those in the diaspora. Even if the I mean, businesses are functioning in Cameroon, but they are owned yeah. by somebody out here. Yeah. Yeah. They're listening, there are many of them who are going to listen to this. You have your yeah. business there in Cameroon, you've got to open something there in Cameroon. 
Yes. Contact Auntie Felicia. Let her do a commercial for you. Let her do an ad for you. And, and trust me, Auntie Felicia works. Um, this is this is this is this looks like a, a pitch, but it's really not. Now I it's think it's supposed to be a pitch. What looks like a pitch? Yes. You're supposed to be it pitching, but like like please pitch. Quite frankly, you will notice that most of the businesses we've worked with have come, have, uh, they, they, they keep coming because they, they have KPIs that they use in measuring whether it's successful. And they've seen tremendous success. We've got putting so much work in conceptualizing. Correct. And so, yes, trust me, it works. For the business that we cannot work with, we, see, we tell you, like, we cannot work we cannot with cannot do this. No, I have one or two people that I'm going to go and actually put or say, hey, you need to give right, yeah. give, 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 give yeah. a call. And I myself yeah. have my own thoughts going on in my head there, but this is what um, any day. First of all, eh, as you be second, no say me, I forget me, I forget me soft spots. <laughs> <laughs> as you say, that thing was so funny. That that how you did for them. So they say you know how the TV extras so when they just did for fun, so they join the dance. <laughs> <laughs> then they, then they say, so then so you actually sing anthem. I shared that yeah. on Sika Pride. People came there and they laughed. They said. Everybody said, Nara Ante, beyond the Boya Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> but but it, shows, it shows you the dedication to details. Right. You know. Right. Yeah. I went and actually said, look at how somebody took the time and learned the first line, lines of the thing. And yes. started the thing and delivered it that it was so credible. Yes. So I, I, I was here watching from the States, watching the actual gala unfold. Every two, three, someone will come, who's an anti Felicia? <laughs> in, the, in the comment, you since you say you go for the airport, whether they, they come and pick you from the airport, it is yeah. there you go and see. I was watching live, I'm talking about live comments when they were there dancing. <laughs> Somebody will come every two minutes around the look, the play who's anti Felicia. The thing and ended it. itself after two two weeks with the Tinder and somebody come back. Anti Felicia will come for that distance. So, <laughs> <laughs> so as, this, oh, as you said it like that, you should, you should know that ad was one of the most difficult to do. You, you will see that I'm not realized because I was contacted the evening before, oh, like I was thing. like, let's say at, at, at 10 p.m. Cameroon time. Mm -hmm. And I'm supposed to put up the ad at 7 a.m. the next day. And oh, I was, they were like, no, you have to do it. I was like, no, I will not do this. I will not, I, I I'll do a boss job. This is not me out. I, I, like, this is too sudden, it's too abrupt. And they were like, please just do whatever you do, no, it will work. It will work. And I was like, I was like, I read them, you know, my people, I will, I will do it. Let me just do it. And I did not ask for anything. I did not ask for a pay. And I just got in the morning and I was like, okay, let me listen to the anthem. And I, I said, okay, I will start now. And we just shot it like one take and it was perfect. Like, perfect, okay, perfect. I still yeah. remember it. I can see all the malarities and, and everything. And we all yeah. watched the thing. Everybody kept saying, and you see that little detail you added there. Yes. The comments that I when I said it on Sika Pride, they came saying, I said for me that the anthem, now the anthem just finished me all together. <laughs> and, so, and that is what also told me this person has done his background work yes. to go and actually look at thing and incorporate this thing, this element into it, and look at how it has just flowed and everything. That is how, and that whole audience, that whole bunch of people there, that that's the whole milieu that you've captured too now. Yeah. We'll be yes. going, and I'm saying it now, I'm saying it now, pitch, 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 we're pitching, we're shamelessly plugging the thing. Yes. <laughs> call her, call her, Auntie Feli, call the, 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 the character yeah. there. And oh, you know, he does all kinds. Auntie Feli, I've seen her, she's the weave. Go put the weave. Oh, God. I saw the one we actually sending somebody's weave in the thing. And I was like, which one did I really look the thing? Like, whether which one fit my head? <laughs> and oh, I was really looking. Like, okay, now. <laughs> I know. It is working. It is working. You're yes. picking and you're helping. This is the fun side of things, society's issues that you bring up, marketing yes. things that are going to be marketed, marketed, that need to be marketed, and then pushing the social issues like the autism and the albinism, like you said. Yes. You, you are really doing a fantastic job. That is the, that degree in sociology. You really have looked at society and you're yes. doing a very important, playing a very important role Thank in so our therapy for laughter, our yes. ability to think and normalize things which are not supposed to be taboo like they are now. You're doing yes. a fantastic job. You're doing a fantastic, uh, fantastic job. Auntie Feli is great. And so is Mr. Elonge. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> tell, tell that fiance, I say thumbs up to her that I cannot wait. I'm very serious. Yes. I cannot wait Don't to have I'll the next. Sure I'll make sure I link you guys. You need to interview her. Right. And just, just have a chat, like this chat. Like just have a no script. I don't have a script. I don't have anything. I've come back no, to put my own thing, my own, added my own hair. <laughs> we get we are twinning, you don't see how. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I'm talking about side. I don't have the single slightest script anywhere. I just said yes. somebody's going to be easy to talk to. From the first minute I contacted you, I'm like, look at how easy he is to just talk to, to just chat with. So I was yeah. saying, it's not an interview is going to be a chat. That, it should be that way. It should be that way. It should be that way. So you yeah. see the real. So you see the real person. It's easier for for everyone, for all of us. You know, as long as there is respect, then we don't have a problem. I think I can only make it difficult for someone who is disrespectful. But even your approach was just so polite, so respectful. The, the, the least one can. What can you say, person who is doing this, and then you come and you're not, you're not. Because I appreciate the talent. I I respect your craft. Yes. I respect your craft. So, so, doing doing this, nobody, any, not a, just any Nyamfuka person all over the place there is somebody who really <laughs> has this part. How dare you? You know, don't come and it's not this person is not the character. The character yeah. is when they're on stage doing or well, not on stage, on stage as such, on the street, they're on the highway doing that talking. We have to forget <laughs> that they, you cannot forget that there's a person behind this. And that's what right. I wanted to bring out. People can see that and know that you're dealing with an yeah. intellectual, you're dealing with yeah. a person. Who is well schooled and who can therefore know how to handle whatever it is that they're trying to do and to bring their way for them to um, put out there for the public. So I am so thankful, so grateful. We we're supposed to do this yesterday, it didn't work. You will get, you will get crashed up party. I go to the, I go to the even black, I go to them black label. I saw they drink, I saw they drink. <laughs> 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 so thank, thank you so much for this short notice for coming and doing this. For, for me, it's a privilege. The, the world does need to see that you're out there and the more even as i keep saying even if one more person knows two more people know it's important but even now many more would know because they've been asking these questions i did not know before now that when we when we started we, we're hoping that oh in a year we might amass twelve thousand, you know uh, 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 twenty four thousand followers well we we've doubled that tripled that you know so to me, it is it is a win. Every one person that acts because we did not expect this, you know, and and so we are very very as a team we are very grateful for all the support we've been receiving, for the love and for all the feedback because uh, people reach out to me. We have our uh, we make mistakes. We have our you know sometimes the people some fans don't even realize the mistakes, but there are people there in the corporate world who are like you know you can you can you can you can tweet you can do this like, or you can do that. Oh, the rest of us are just there laughing, laughing away. We don't, yeah. we don't see those little things which, which they're talking about. I really appreciate everyone who, who has, who has, you know, who has this in mind and looking at the success and seeing this as something which could, which could be representative of Cameroonian comedy. I cannot global. wait. I, I cannot so, yeah. wait. So, and hey, that I see that thing on Netflix. Ooh, okay. just a public, public holiday. Just sit down and be yeah. sharing, sharing, sharing. <laughs> <laughs> and making noise and subscribing, go get your Netflix. Yes, and watch. I cannot I wait for that. that. I can do a tour before this year runs out. Um, out to do a tour there and come to uh, Europe and America. So I, I hope. We, now, we, now, we, now, we, now that now that COVID, because that COVID was the thing too that also held yeah. everything back. Now that everything is clearing up and everything, yeah. no, definitely. So we have yeah. all our conventions and things that we hold. We keep on only calling the artists for the dance, dance, dance. Now it's time to actually have to call somebody to come and do that, to advertise it and then to feature. It's yes. time for us to see the comedians see, on the poster too, where you see this, this artist is standing there too. Comedians, comedians will do a better job. This is no shade to the others, but the comedians I know, first of all, come with a lot of humility. Mm -hmm. And to me, that's one of the things about artists. Mm -hmm. they, about artists, like artists should be humble. And mm -hmm. comedians, the ones I know, and who are leading now, they come with a lot of humility. They are so focused on the job and not the fame. And they, they, they are so self, you know, self-aware, you right. know, about what they have to do and deliver all the time. So I feel like people have a really good time with comedians. They will be without all the hassle and stress of, of the, this. The diva, I know what you're talking about, the diva thing about how this, uh, you, uh, uh, before I come, you have to keep my yeah, five bottles of Avian and Perrier. At room temperature. These are people who 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 live who live by making people laugh. So they will not make it difficult for you. I mean, the people who have reached out to me, they are all like, "My God, you 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 are so accessible." And easy I was like, "Easy to deal yeah. with, easy to get along with, easy to just easy." Try to get, try to, get to Karu and Kopis. Try to get to Dokas, and I can vouch that it will be as easy as getting to me. Right. If they are all... do one, very soon is have the team. 
have the team yes. come, 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 on, come on together because I'm glad you've mentioned their names. Kudos yes. to them. Kudos yes. to them. And tell them we are, we are really, we are really proud. And that's, mm -hmm. that shows the humility there. Instead of coming to sit and say, it's just me. You've been saying it's a team. You're only as strong as a team. You even said about who are smarter than you. That's hard to imagine. Who are smarter yes. than that? Yes. <laughs> Probably smarter than you are already. <laughs> Fantastic. You can, you can see from the character, you can read from a character, from a person. Yeah, say that you, you will not be that, you will not be that door picking. <laughs> you don't give me bad, get inherit bad genes from your papa. <laughs> I tell you. <laughs> so thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I know it's getting a little over for, there for you and everything. Exactly. But thank you so much. You it's like I've been chatting with you forever. It's forever. So I feel like I know you. But I was already sitting here laughing by myself. Can you imagine looking at an empty screen and already laughing before the person shows up? <laughs> <laughs> oh god. I mean, this cover, I'm like, oh my gosh. Yes, the cover really fits you well, well. Mm -mm. Yeah, and now you don't you don't move the short. You be, if, if it used to be short, you don't promote that now to head tie. No, again, tie, when you deal with that with that a, a, a green up, ah now come and see. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that is a I should know one day I really look there a green up so I said, what's that this man will get this green up with some bow for this? <laughs> <laughs> this I should tell you, I think, you know, from a spiritual place, I actually think that my, my mom blessed this. But that uh, that top came from the market. So when I decided to start this, I launched a character on Karan Kopi's platform. Right, 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 right. When I was going to get like what outfits I wear, I went to the market with my closest friend, Joan Gumba. She's a secret and she, she's into media and everything. And right. when she was taking me to where she buys her, you know, when you buy okay, a then please please buy her. So she took she took me to a lady and the, this is a mother and she I, I I she wanted to give me something fancy and I like no this is a comedy I don't want something too fancy you know let me select and I picked up that out and she was like she can never sell that <laughs> so, so was that bad <laughs> yeah she gave it to me and she was like but know that whatever you want to do with it will be a success Ooh. and you know sadly I forgot when all the success came I forgot about her until. This day when Joan went to the market, I was like, hey, mommy talks to that. I mean, mommy the talk say it is still all side, it is still all side. I was so ashamed of myself because I had forgotten. I you know, sometimes you forget where you start from. And I, I made sure, trust me, I made sure that I made up. You went back to go, no, to go. You see how a, a blessing from a person she says, may this go when you wear it, may it bring you success. And it has. It has. I, you see, that was the first thing I asked you. I said, what's that green, this, that green, that lime green top? <laughs> oh, that one is priceless. And even this, this was given to me by a friend's mom. Oh. Like, oh, she, she, she's so in love with, with what we're doing. What you're doing. Yes. And she was like, she doesn't know what she can give to me. She's not very wealthy, but she wanted to make Has sure that I... you with... Yes. And she gave me this. So I, I, all of this, I cherish a lot. Like, I really cherish. Particularly when it comes to my mother, you know. Oh. I, all right. It, it explains your success. I can, I'm listening to you and I'm saying, how will it not succeed? There's no way for it not to. When yes. you have the attitude that you have, you have the train that you have, you're inherently funny as a person. I do not see how this can stop. That Netflix will be only a springboard. Right. You can sit down there in a, in, a, in, a, in a place to and watch a thing. I don't tire. Nigeria, Nigeria, Ghana, Ghana. What about Cameroon? <laughs> no, it's, 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 you're going and you're pushing it out there. Anything that we can do, if it's just noise, provide a platform and just make the noise. When I put this out there, that's what I'll be saying. Don't watch this thing till you're going to subscribe. Go over there. Go to YouTube. It will say, you start to just type anti Felicia comedy. Bam! It just shows yes. up right there. You will see the, either the lime green thing or you will see this cover right there. Like, 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 like. Just, just like it. Don't even watch first. Just like it first. Then, yes. you, hit, then you share, 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 share. Those numbers matter. People look at them and that's how they know that something is growing and is good and people can monetize and all of that stuff. And, and that's what then, gives, even the corporate partnerships that we have is the numbers. Yes. Correct. Correct. So if you have not done so, what, don't, 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 we don't want to embarrass you and call your name here. <laughs> go do it before, before you can you can leave the show now. Go. You can go now. Yeah. Don't wait for the thing to close. Go. <laughs> Go and go and, and like the thing and share it. Don't go, don't let the sun set. And you go to church and sit on Sunday. Mm, 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 God is not listening. <laughs> God is not listening. Go back and go and do this thing. That's, it, it doesn't cost a thing. If you are hearing subscription, you think you need to be paying per month. And no, there's a red button. It says subscribe. Click. 
click from your cell phone, from anything, and then share and tell somebody else to click. Let's click, click, click. That's how all those one million views you see there for those other people you're seeing. That's how it happens. It's not the one to come and pray and anything and bind anything. You have to take your hand and clicking. It does not. No. You know, you know, everybody come down from heaven and say, Thou shalt click, blah, blah, on a loudspeaker. <laughs> you're, you're bringing out, you're bringing out whatever bit of comedy is in me, you're bringing it right out. I'm like, I'm like who is that fellow here? It will be you. <laughs> I tell you, this thing just bothers me. You're telling somebody to go click. Why are you not clicking? Why it's you go and do a little button and do this. Thing. And you're not doing it. Why? 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 It's so easy. Go do it and just like. Why do you have to even see the content? Ask the thing <laughs> so click and click the next one, click, 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 then come back and look. Oh, <laughs> so, so thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Congratulations for and keep up the good work. There are a ton for every one of me you're sitting here, there are like 10,000 others who who want who wish the best for you, from the mummy in the market to everybody else. You have done a lot, a lot to do for our mental health. That's the truth. So, Obo, so keep on going. Amen. <laughs> you, you have a last word for us before we, we, we close? Oh, I just want to say that um, I really appreciate this platform first because um, it's not every day we have opportunities like this where platform is used for the promotion of the local art. So I want to appreciate you for, for the work you've been doing. Uh, trust me, when you reached out, I was like, I'll go and read your CV and, and say everything. And like, you know, you've been doing such, a, such an incredible job. And just like you're telling people to follow, people should follow your channel and everything and follow your show. And this, this is this is this is one of the best interviews, if not the best interviews. I've had. It doesn't feel like an interview. Yeah, and that's what that, that warms my heart too, because I don't want you to feel that way. That's in a walk. I should go and prepare, prepare. No, go be jarring a book there to read a little encyclopedia. No, so just come and be you. And that's why it's clear, it's clear. Anybody who was not sure about the thing. They have watched this now. They know this is the person unscripted. There you go. There you go. Go and you don't go. You have to your business go past. This is it right here. This is the real deal <laughs> right here. Next time, bring the whole team along here and let's keep pushing our own. Please, please, please support our own. Support them. So thank, thank you so much, and I wish you only the very best. God bless you. And you'll be hearing from me. I'm going to find something for you to advertise. Trust me. Okay. <laughs> All right, you take care now. Okay, you too. All right, bye. bye. <laughs>